What are you kids doing on my lawn? Pork chop sandwiches. Hey kids, stop all the downloading. Help computer. Who wants a body massage? Body massage. I bought the Art of G.I. Joe, a real American hero on this hardcover. I thought it's a great companion piece for uh, the G.I. Joe field manuals. Just here's like a size comparison for them. Anyway, let's get with the unboxing. This thing's pretty heavy. So what we have here is the clamshell slipcase. Let's get that off. So it got a little bit damaged during shipping, but whatever, that's okay. That's the reason why it's a case and not the actual book itself. So here's how the back looks like. Really love the paintings of the G.I. Joe battle, just like uh, when you were a kid. All right. So this is a folder, and it comes with a bunch of different prints in it. And some more on this side as well. So the inside cover of the case has some more uh, toy dossiers. But let's get to the main event, the book itself. Then here's the inside cover as well for the bottom. All right, so there's the cover. Let's start going inside. <laughs> This is cool. Pictures of uh, kids holding their toys. And then, I think these are pretty much life-size uh, versions of the artwork. So if you look on the sides, it looks like it's organized by year. And then there's a couple of fold outs as well. So this isn't just the toy art, they also have a uh, little artwork from the TV series as well.
skip ahead a bit. And of course, you gotta have Sergeant Slaughter. Otherwise, you'd be a useless maggot. And then here they have an artist profile on Douglas Hart, who was the one responsible for a lot of the artwork on these packages. All right, so I was a kid of the 90s, and Ninja Force was all the rage at school. Like, we didn't care about any of the other G.I. Joes. Especially look at this Storm Shadow design. It's pretty sick. I always like the, having the black accents on his costume. And then, yeah, towards uh, 1994 or 95, that's pretty much when the toy line sort of just stopped, ran out of ideas, you know? Star Brigade. Dude, do you know anyone that ever had the G.I. Joe aircraft carrier? That's insane. That thing was huge. But yeah, that's the omnibus book. I know uh, it's mostly just uh, the action figure art, but if again, if you want to check out the cartoon art, you can get the G.I. Joe field manuals from IDW. They're the ones that have like the model sheets from uh, the different episodes with all the various characters and vehicles in them. So yeah, the 
it's a good companion piece to have if you're a big G.I. Joe fan. So if you take off the dust jacket, the inside of it is uh, the artwork without all the text. 